Wagwan, welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, I'm going to show you guys a couple new products that I copped. So firstly, I went in with my Pons Moisturizer and I moisturized the skin. Then I went in with the Elf Camo, with the Elf Grip Summer Primer, and I went in with the green one and I placed that all over my skin. Now that I'm looking like a glazed donut, I went in with the Revlon. The Revlon Photo Ready Primer to mattify the skin and kind of hide the pores. Let's talk about the Elf Primer a little bit. Um, I don't really, I don't really like it. It's 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 not my gig, but it's very hydrating. But it's not really my type of primer. Now, as you can see, I'm going. I went in with the Elf Camo Concealer. This concealer is nice. It's cool. It's creamy. It's full coverage. It's blend out like a dream but like i've used the matte one this one is a hydrating one i've used the matte one but this one something in it that irritate my eyes as you can see in that clip after i blend out the prime the concealer you guys, you guys can see that my eyes are immensely red like whenever i put this underneath my eyes it my eyes start to burn me feel a heavy I don't know. I've used the matte one. I've never experienced this. I've, this is the second time using the concealer and I've experienced this. So I'm not using back that primer on my that concealer on my so you see my eyes are red and watery. As you can see, yeah, <laughs> I'm clearly moving faster than how I'm speaking. But I went in with the Laura, Laura Mercier Translucent Honey setting powder. The shade is honey. This powder nice, like I'm not the type to jump on trends and whatever. I always wait until it died down and I try it for myself if I still want to try it. But this powder is a really nice powder. Like it's smooth, it's really nice. So after I set the concealer, I did a little tops of baking because man, I know all my nose looks so broad, girl. Like I don't understand. Like I've put on a couple pounds, but why are you going on my nose? Anyways, <laughs> I'm going in with the LA Girl, LA Girl Face Powder. I don't remember the exact name. And I use that to set my foundation. There, I went in with a powder. I think it's a Black Radiance. from the, A powder from Black Radiance Contour Palette. And I'm using that to contour the hell out of my nose. And my nose looks too fat. With fat nose I got not around here. So, after I contoured my nose... I went in and I set my contoured ears. I set it as well as I was bronzing up my face and my face look more, you know, sun kiss. Look at my bronzy, bronzy, bronzy. Anywho, I did the same thing on the other side. And as I told you guys in the last tutorial, I love that brush. I love that brush so much. Like, my alpha go by like couple more of these brushes well I really do like the brush then I'm going to go in with a shade I went in a shade from out the Juvia's palette the Juvia Zulu palette yeah I went in the pink one and I'm using that as blush today and again as I said in the previous tutorial I really do like these brushes so I just blush up the skin make it look like the girl is blushing from within then I went in and I set my eyebrows so this tutorial today is really shorter than the next and as you guys are realizing that it's moving faster than how I'm speaking but after I set the brows and I set my eyelids, I went in with the... Why does the clip look like that? I'm not sure why the clip is jumping. But I went in with the same shade I used to bronze up my face. I'm putting that in the crease of my lids and just blowing it out. Like a cut crease. Not cut crease, like girl, I wish I cut crease like a smoky eye kind of vibe. I just blow it out because I wanted to add some color in there and fun fact i was actually going out and i was going to do like a get ready with me and i was like i have some products that i would never told you guys that i've been using so you know what let me say let's throw it out in this tutorial like yeah i finally 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 got back my hands on my maybelline 
lasting fix setting spray i love this spray i love it so much i love it especially paired with a red blonde primer so i use that and set the entirety of my face like your makeup place really does not move but anyways we are getting to the last part of the video so i'll see you guys in the next tutorial i hope you enjoyed this one and until then go and big up on yourself and continue to be simply amazing